It is the end of the Ice Age, and death for man comes swift and often. Over the next five minutes, you'll experience the harshest time in the history of mankind. This is how Far Cry does the Stone Age. You are Takar, a seasoned warrior of the Winja tribe, known as the Beastmaster. To survive, you must embark on a savage adventure filled with brutal weapons, warring tribes, and mystical journeys. Takar and his people are at the very bottom of the food chain, threatened by man and beast alike. To overcome his many foes, Takar has powerful weaponry at his disposal. Durable clubs, versatile spears, and various forms of the deadly bow and arrow create the foundation of his arsenal. He can craft even deadlier weapons using rare materials found throughout the world. The double bow and arrow takes out two enemies at once, and the addition of fire can turn a cave bear into a flaming ball of destruction. Berserker bombs turn enemies against each other, while bee bombs create lethal distractions. Slings, traps, and other weapons round out Takar's equipment, affording him unlimited creativity in how he approaches each threat. Especially when confronted with fortresses and strongholds brimming with dangerous warriors. Takar has his own special mastery. With the ability to tame and command wild beasts, he ascends from prey to predator. His constant owl companion provides many benefits, from aerial scouting to executing enemies. And other animals provide a variety of useful abilities. With badgers terrifying other wildlife, great cats stealthily eliminating enemies, and bears causing mayhem in combat. Some animals can also be ridden, granting Takar mobility in battle and across this great expanse of land. In order to save mankind, Takar will have to conquer other tribes. Led by the maniacal Ur, the Udam are vicious cave dwellers that attack upon sight. For them, hunting man is no different than hunting beasts. Meat is meat. The only people the Udam hate more than the Winja are the Azila and their merciless leader, Batari. Worshippers of the Sun God, the Azila enslave their victims and terrify foes with their mastery of fire. Wildlife is not the only thing that is plentiful in this world. Lush landscape provides the materials Takar needs to craft his wide assortment of tools. A gifted hunter, Takar can read every facet of his environment. In order to rebuild his village, he'll need to use these talents to find rescue, and protect lost members of the Winja tribe. To unlock the full potential of his village, Takar must acquire the resources necessary to build proper shelters. Newly recruited specialists help advance various techniques, and a larger population allows for the spiritual journeys that might just save the Winja from extinction. <laughs> Nightfall poses many new dangers, even for a Beastmaster, as there's nothing more terrifying than being hunted in the dark. With human survival hanging in the balance, and his life in constant peril, Takar must fight against all odds to rise above extinction.